Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This time I'm going to continue the Allied Force uh, campaign. My next mission is a strike mission against uh, a specific bridge. So we'll see whether the weather will be better and uh, <laughs> whether the uh, visibility will be uh, much better. I hope so, so I'll be able to find my ground target without any problems. Uh, my F-16 Block 50 should be armed with uh, six AMRAMs and uh, six Marks 82s. There are the small, smaller bombs, basically. So hopefully I'll be able to destroy the bridge like completely. I'll be dropping the bombs in uh, pairs just to have like better chance to destroy the bridge by, I don't know, maybe one or two drops only. taking quite long to hold the mission. Usually these last like two pictures on this loading screen are very quickly. And sometimes the game is doing this. I don't know. I've never seen something like this before. Usually the longest one is the middle picture. Zero one zero two hundred forty miles seven thousand. Okay, Chalice, finally. Launch activity detected. Bullseye zero two five sixty miles. Chalice, Looks like something is wrong Hustle with the zero two five two hundred miles eighteen thousand. The sound itself. I'm surprised how long does it take just to load the sound of the game now. Hopefully this will be a okay flight okay-ish flight at least. So let's go for the takeoff. Steel point 2 selected already which is somewhere close to the initialization point already. So let's go for the takeoff. So I'm carrying six Amram's C5s, which is perfect. The best available missile for me now. And I'm carrying uh, six Mark 82s. I'll set up them uh, once airborne. Not going, not going to play with it now. I have to slightly think about it, how to set up them. Gypsy 1 1, request clearance for departure. Gypsy 1 1, Palese Machi, tower, position and hold, runway 2 6. Palese Machi. <laughs> As you can see, there is still a storm outside, so the weather is still not, not so great. Although I can see the, some city in the distance, so it seems like uh, the weather might be, or the visibility might be better, but... Gypsy, 1-1. One, one. Palese Mashi, tower, you are cleared for takeoff. Runway 26, depart heading 170. Okay, depart Gypsy, heading 170, one, so Palese going for takeoff. Tower. Hold short. Runway 26, Gypsy, one, two. then turning Mashi, left to Position heading 170. Gypsy, one, two, Palestine, Mashi, Tower, you are cleared to Altitude, 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 Altitude,
Gypsy 1 1. Palace Mashi. Departure. Resume own navigation. 2 Airborne. In such visibility like is currently now here in South Italy, I should be able to uh, positively identify the target just visually. And I should be able to drop my uh, my ordnance, my bombs, also visually. So I'm going to set up uh, my bomb drop for visual. Gypsy, one two, Palace Mashi, departure. Resume own navigation. In case that the target won't be visible. I'm going for the uh, CCRP, which is the uh, radar drop, basically. So let's set up the bombs for the visual bombing now. So CCIP selected. CCIP means constantly computed impact point. So I'll see the reticle down on the ground, exactly at the point where the bombs will will uh, drop or will hit the ground if I now press the trigger. I'm gonna release one pair per each uh, trigger press and uh, that's it maybe so each trigger press will release like two bombs and that's it okay I'm not carrying any <laughs> it's not visible from outside so I have to check it from here I'm not carrying any uh, any fuel tanks, so just just one EZM pot under my center line hard point. Uh, then on the inner hard points, I'm carrying uh, three marks 82s on each pylon, left right side, and then there are like six amrams on the outer pylons on the end. So that's all my pay payload. Uh, let's go to HSD. Okay, that's it. It stays in the jettison. Stops jettison. Okay, like this. Navigation now. Okay. Still zero visibility in like 16,000 feet. So I will be. Or I, I'll have to fly really low during the bombing run. But the cloud layer might be, might be completely different here in uh, South Italy and in uh, Bosnia Herzegovina on the other side of the the uh, Adriatic Sea. So we'll see. Uh, just to set up everything properly, let's switch off the lights. I'm already. Uh, I, I I'll. I was already flying to the cloud, so I'm visible now. Let's use the master arm. Let's activate the EZM. Electronic countermeasures select to program 4, which is OK. Chalice 2, device, hostile launch activity detected, bullseye. And that's it. Uh, I'm going to switch back to briefing. OK. My call sign Gypsy 1. My wingman Gypsy 1 2. And I'm going to strike uh, Virpazar Bridge. So, hopefully, I'll be able to do so. Let me check the situation in the air. Sentry 1, Gypsy 1 1. Request vector to threat. Gypsy 1, Sentry 1. I don't have any targets. Okay, no threat. What about picture? What about some Sentry attack one, aircrafts? Gypsy 1 1. Picture. Gypsy 1-1, entry 1, clear. Okay, the situation seems to be pretty clear, so let's use the time compression just to make this video as uh, short as possible. I think it will be pretty boring to simply watch how I fly through some cloud layer for half an hour. I can see some contact in the 64, somewhere here, 64, 62 or 60 miles ahead, 59, okay. We'll see what this is, let me check the situation with my AVAX. 
Gypsy, one one, Sentry, one. Picture is multiple groups. Nearest bandit bearing three three zero forty miles. Ten thousand. Okay, some attack aircrafts are down below. Let me check for the threats now. Okay, some threat is uh, 320 or 325, 35 miles, 10,000. So I'm going to check them. One, Ask for update. One, one. Request vector to threat. Gypsy one, sentry one, nearest threat. Me twenty nine, bearing three one zero thirty five miles, ten thousand. Okay, that's him. Sentry one, gypsy one one, declare. Gypsy one one, sentry one, contact confirmed hostile. By Gypsy me twenty nine. And there is another contact gypsy here one, in. Sentry one, gypsy one one, declare. Gypsy 11, Sentry 1, contact confirmed hostile by GS 232. Okay, so it's a MiG 29 working as an escort or acting as an escort for SU 32 for an attack aircraft. Uh, ideally, I would like to destroy both of these groups. So let's go for the MiG 29 first. I have no information whether this is the single aircraft or double aircraft or three ship formation, so we'll see later on. It should be already visible on my radar. Let's increase the speed so my launch uh, variables or round, launch paramet parameters for the Amram will be better. So it will be the probability of the kill will be uh, will be higher as well if you launch your Amrams in the uh, in the thicker air, uh, sorry thinner air and uh, with higher init initial speed basically. So the target is very quickly going Gypsy into one, my Gypsy one, one. Declare. wrench. Gypsy one one sentry one contact confirmed hostile. IG is me twenty nine. Looks like he's turning. The closure speed is re is being reduced, so it seems like he's uh, speeding up a little bit. No! So he's definitely using his afterburner now, as you can see. He's keeping himself outside my uh, my vez, which is the weapon employment zone. I can see some 16s in front of me, which is uh, F-16s. It's those those targets here on my radar, basically. They are closing to this uh, MiG-29. Lost the track. Maybe it was destroyed by the... It might be destroyed by the Patriot, I don't know. I have lost the track already, which is not ideal. Sentry one, Gypsy one one, request vector to threat. Gypsy one, Sentry one, nearest threat, me twenty nine, Singleton bearing two four five ten miles, ten thousand. Okay, now I can see him again. It's almost in range, but still not enough. Just, just almost. Okay, looks like he's turning back. Let me fire my Amram now. Okay, there should be there should be no escape from this Amram anymore. Let's see that impact, but it, the target is in 10,000 feet, so it will, it will be basically impossible to see this impact. You can see the, see the speed of the Amram, it was like 1200 while hitting this uh, MiG-29. So he's definitely killed.
Okay, he's losing altitude and soon he will disappear from my radar. Set the bingo for... I've already used half of my fuel amount. Sentry 1, Gypsy 1-1, one, one. request vector to threat. Gypsy 1, Sentry 1, I don't have any targets. Okay, no threat. Sentry 1, Gypsy 1-1, one, one. picture. Gypsy 1-1, one, one. Sentry 1, picture is multiple groups. Nearest bandit bearing 315, 10 miles, 7,000. Chalice 2, device, hostile launch activity detected, bullseye, 065. 315, 10 miles, 6000, very low. Oh, this target here. What's this? Sentry 1, Gypsy 1-1, one, one. declare. Gypsy 1-1, one, one. Sentry 1, contact is friendly. Sentry 1, Gypsy 1-1, one, one. picture. Gypsy 1-1, one, one. Sentry 1, picture is multiple groups. Nearest bandit bearing 325, 15 miles, 7,000. I have to tilt, tilt my antenna down just to see the target, which is 15 miles ahead and uh, 7,000 only. That's him. Sentry 1, Gypsy 1-1, one, one. declare. Gypsy 1-1, one, one, Sentry 1, contact confirmed hostile by Jesus, Sue 32. 1, Fox. Altitude, 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 altitude. What just happened? Altitude. Altitude, 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 How that I am in altitude, 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 zero altitude, 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 altitude. My altitude is zero. Now, oh my God, what's that? What was that? Something is really wrong with this mission. Sentry 1, Gypsy 1-1, one, one. picture. Gypsy 1-1, one, one. Sentry 1, picture clear. Okay, picture clear, so let's continue my mission. Looks like the SU-32 was shot down already by me while I was in the zero altitude. Chalice 2, advise hostile aircraft bearings 045, 160 miles, 9000. Sentry 1, Gypsy 1-1, one, one. picture. Gypsy 1-1, one, one. Sentry 1, picture clear. Sentry 1, Gypsy 1-1, one, one. picture. Gypsy 1-1, one, one. Sentry 1, picture clear. I'm quite low on fuel, which is not good. I might not be able to reach the target. I should uh, fly back already. Uh, let me check the tanker. Sentry 1, Gypsy 1-1, one, one. request vector to tank. Gypsy 1, Sentry 1, tanker, canteen 1, bearing 3, 4, 5, 120 miles. Tap and channel 125, Yankee. Okay, it's about 120 miles. I have like 70 miles to the uh, initialization point. Uh, but my fuel amount currently is uh, 2,700. My fuel consumption is uh, 5,000. So I might be able to fly like this for half an hour. 
it is seven minutes to the not it is uh, eight minutes to the target I'll be down below in a really uh, more denser air with higher fuel consumption and then I have to fly again again high again climb so it will be really neck and neck on the uh, with the fuel consumption with the fuel amount at the end of this mission I'm not sure whether I should continue this mission maybe I'm going to divert to my home base right now what about my wingman Safe fuel. He should be okay with the fuel. What is your fuel state? Two fuel state four thousand. Four thousand. Okay, so he's he's pretty much okay with the fuel. Unlike me, I was using the afterburner quite a lot, quite a lot for just just to catch the MiG twenty nine. Oh, uh, what to do? What to do? Two thousand six hundred fuel consumption. 5,000 If I fly higher I might be able to save some fuel but uh, probably not enough Okay uh, listen, I'm going to continue this mission. I'm going to change the uh, drop boat to the CCRP. I'm going to drop all my bombs at once. So, really, spurs will be three, it will be three pairs. Like all six bombs will be dropped just by one, uh, just by one trigger press, and the spacing between the bombs will be only one feet. So I'll, I'll drop all my bombs basically into one spot, almost one one big hole. So I have to be pretty accurate with the uh, with the targeting of my my bomb. My bombs, not just one. It'll be six bombs. But I'm going to continue this mission. Hopefully, my wingman will be also able to release his bombs. I'm gonna drop them from uh, 20,000 feet. So let's start to descend. I'm not going to fly any lower than 20,000 feet. I'm going to drop them, turn back, and climb again into, let's say, 35,000 feet or something like that. So I'll I'll save as much fuel as possible. That's my hope. I still can't see the target on my radar. It's uh, more than 40 miles, which is my current range. Oh, there are multiple targets here, so I have to switch for... I have to switch it back now. Okay, somehow I can't reduce the range. F-22 on my RWR, which is perfect, I like it. Okay, there are two dots, two small dots. And there were two bridges on the on the target side, so this should be this should be it. It's probably probably this target here. Okay, now I can switch it back. Forty miles. Okay, let's lock this target here. It should be it. Ok, 
Okay, let's level up. I'm completely off the drop line, so let's fly properly. Like this, slightly to the right. It will be a miracle if I hit this uh, hit this target right now. Okay, unable to change to twenty miles still. One, two, one, three. Oh, I'm completely off again. Two, welcome. SU-30 or SU-27SM. Both of them are possible, so let's drop the bombs and let's fly away. I hope that F-22s will be able to... Okay, my wingman is firing Amrams. Gypsy 1, Sentry 1, be advised. Hostiles bearing 070, 15 miles, 26,000. 2, Pitbull. Bingo. Bingo. I can't see the square with Two, the target, bingo. so I have to fly like this. Two, five, three, medium. Altitude, altitude. <laughs> completely. Probably completely off the target. One bandit is already burning, going down. Sentry one, Gypsy one one, request vector to threat. Gypsy one, Sentry one, I don't have any targets. Okay, no threat anymore. Sentry one, Gypsy one one, picture. Gypsy one one, Sentry one, picture is multiple groups. Nearest bandit bearing three five zero five lines, sixteen thousand. Gypsy, one, two, I have become dead. The shatterer of worlds. Chalice, three, advise hostile aircraft bearing three, four, five, eighty miles, ten thousand. How much fuel does? One, one thousand seven hundred. I don't know why the warning is already on. It shouldn't be active. I don't know what's going on. I'm still okay with the fuel. Looks like my wingman is not, not attacking the ground target. Now he's locking it. Okay, he's going for the ground target. You can see it on the HSD. He locked the target number two, which means the Gypsy one two. Okay. 
attitude zero it's the bridge directly on the steer point so he's going to drop his bombs i'm going to let him perfect he's dropping his bombs so hopefully he be, he'll be able to uh, destroy this bridge and he's winchester already so drop stars and not follow me okay Okay, let's fly home. I'm not going to follow any any bandits. My highest priority is now just to return this aircraft to the ground. Which will be the best I can do. I'm pretty sure that my bombs uh, went off the target. Definitely not hitting the target. I was uh, quite high, completely off the square with the with the target. So. It went somewhere in the into the field, but I hope that my wingman was able to hit the target. Okay, one thousand one hundred, which is still okay. Gypsy 1, Sentry 1, be advised. Hostiles bearing 315, 30 miles, 30,000. Sentry 1, Gypsy 1, 1. Request vector to threat. Gypsy 1, Sentry 1, nearest threat, Su-27s, 4 ship, bearing 315, 25 miles, 30,000. Chalice 2, be advised. Hostile launch activity detected. Bullseye 020, 120 miles. Gypsy 1, 2, request permission to engage. Flight Gypsy 1 2, weapons free. Sentry 1, Gypsy, Gypsy 1 2, Gypsy 1 1, engage Sioux 1, Pickle. 1, Fox 3, long. Okay, now the fuel is 1000 only. Or below 1000 already. 1, Pickle. 1, Fox 3, medium. Okay, let's turn home. Splash 1, Splash 2. My last missile is Pitbull, but the first aircraft still seems to be flying. Oh, he's already killed. Okay, splash. Okay, let's fly home as well. One, bingo. The airfield is just 30 miles in front of us. We have one MiG-29 behind one, us. Gypsy, one, one. Request vector to threat. 
Gypsy, one, entry, one, nearest threat, me, 29, singleton, bearing, three, four, five, four miles, 10,000. Gypsy, one, two, Gypsy, one, one, weapons check. Gypsy, one, entry, one, be advised, hostiles bearing, three, five, zero, four miles, 10,000. 10, 10,000. And only 4 miles. He's very close to me. This will be really, really difficult landing with the MiG 29 behind you. Hopefully, the Patriot will be active. And the wingman is not responding to me anymore. Once he reaches bingo, he's just going for the landing and doesn't, doesn't want to do anything. Okay, no answer from him. Let me send him home. Return to base. Hopefully he will confirm. One, two, return to base. Chalice 2, be advised. Hostile launch activity detected. Bullseye 060, 80 miles. Gypsy 1-1, one, one, inbound for landing. Gypsy 1-1, one, one, descend to 2000. Maintain 270 knots. Turn left heading 190. Vectors to final. Runway 26. Sentry 1, Gypsy 1-1. One, one. Request vector to threat. Gypsy 1, Sentry 1, nearest threat. Me 29, Singleton. Bearing 350, 15 miles. 3000. Okay, he's 15 Gypsy miles one, already, one. so he's going detect. back. Gypsy 1-1, one, one. descend to 2000, maintain 270 knots, turn Altitude. left heading Altitude. 185, vectors to final, runway 26. Chalice 2, advise hostile aircraft bearing 040, 220 miles, 18,000. Gypsy 1-1, one, one. descend to 2000, maintain 230 knots, vectors to final, runway 26. He turned back. You can see Gypsy me now. One, Gypsy one, one. Request vector to threat. Gypsy one, entry one, nearest threat. Me twenty nine, Singleton bearing three five five, twenty five miles, five thousand. Okay, twenty five miles already. So this should be okay. I'm getting out of his missile range, basically. Gypsy, 1, 2, descend to 2000, maintain 220 knots, turn right heading 235, vectors to final, runway 26. Gypsy, 1, 1, turn right to final approach course, 260, check approach speed. Can't see the runway correctly. 260, okay, so... I can see some two, Gypsy, one, two. Perform landing check. white dots on the ground, which should be the runway. Okay, let me use it. Good afternoon, Cheat. Gypsy. One, one. Palace Mashi. Power cleared for landing. Runway two six. Tech gear down. Okay, slightly to the right, and I should be aligned with the runway, hopefully. Let's watch the fence, there is always a fence in all these bases here, so you have to fly all over it. It's very high and it's very close to the runway, so always be careful about fences. Just now, just below me. Gypsy, one, two, turn right to final approach course, two, six, zero, check speed. Okay, I've landed. Pingman is somewhere behind me, going for land as well. He's turning uh, on the final already. 
So I should clear the runway as fast as possible. Gypsy 1 1, clear runway, incoming traffic. I was just going to say that you are never uh, that fast as uh, ATC wants, so usually she will say you to clear, the, clear runway. But I do not see any exit from here. Okay, it's on the right side, finally. Let's exit the runway. Gypsy, one one, clear runway, incoming traffic. I know, I know, sorry for that. Good afternoon, Gypsy, one two, Palace Mashi, power, cleared for landing, runway two six, tech gear down. Okay, he will be going for the landing now. And I'm going out of this simulation into the main menu. So let's see the result. Let's see how my six bombs uh, killed uh, one cucumber in the field somewhere. Six misses like this. But the Amram hits uh, five of them hits. The last was a miss. I was shooting at the Su-27, which was already targeted by by my wingman. One Su-27 just damage probably that was the last one which was destroyed by my wingman pretty impressive performance like four air to air kills three air to air kills so together seven air to air kills during this mission and it was su 27s sm but it, it looks like they are not carrying the r 77s m already like they used to on the on the first days of the uh, of the campaign, my wingman also missed all his uh, all his bombs, which is perfect. So the so the bridge is still here, but I don't see it uh, it's somewhere here. One of these bridges was Irpazar Bridge. Pirpaza bridge. It was one of these bridges, probably this one. So it's completely still operational. No damage to him. Let me check where is the bridge and where is the village. Okay, there's the bridge, there's the village. It's very hard to destroy anything on ground when you can can't see it. You know, the visual is always pretty demanding. It's the sixth day of the of the campaign. Maybe I'm going to fast forward it a little bit. I just need to wait for better weather. I do not want to bomb. Okay, look at this. Look at this rate. Probably my runway will be destroyed now. Chalice 2, be advised. Threat aircraft bullseye. 0, 070, 0, 35 miles. 9000. Chalice 2, be advised. Hostile launch activity detected. Bullseye. 025, 140 miles. Right. First strike, 80% operational. Runway repaired. Repaired, repaired. Okay, so it was hit. It's already repaired. And what about the Amendola, which was my initial, where is the runway, which was my initial 0% operational. There is no, no engineers available here. What about this supply battalion? I didn't, I wasn't able to find any engineers. One of them are on this Ginoliza supply battalion, like this. This E letter is the engineers, but they are usually supplies or engineers, and I can't see any free engineers here. Engineer battalion, that's great. Let's move them to Amendola Air Base during the night. Hopefully, they'll be able to reach the base. 
and uh, repair it. So I'm going to continue from this Palace Machi in my next mission. Uh, probably I'm going to fast forward this to the next morning and I'll hope it will be the weather will be basically better. Look at this rate here. They are going to splash everything completely like It must be a complete destruction now Seed strike here 1855 seed strike what is the target of the seed so there is a seed strike, two F-16s, seed escort, escorted by four Typhoons, escort against fighters with uh, another four Typhoons, so together eight Typhoons, two F-16s, and one U-2 just to uh, make photos after the uh, hit. And the target is some air base, strike enemy air defense assets. Uh, p -p 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 Yugoslavian... 247th Air Defense Battalion located 8 nautical miles southwest of Gorazje consists of several SA-6 missile launchers which are preventing additional strikes from entering enemy airspace. The command wants these defenses eliminated. So, my target is the SA-6 Battalion but there should be also some SA-10 in this area. Probably it was already destroyed but... Uh, and uh, SA-6, this 8 nautical miles uh, north, uh, southwest, southeast from the Gorazde. So I'm going to fly this mission in my next video, but uh, okay, I'm going to take fuel tanks. I was just going to say that I would need a fuel tank for such mission, just to extend my range. Let's switch to C5 Amrams onto all my pylons, and this will be a nice mission almost night night mission so let's save the progress and i will fly this in my next video guys thank you for watching as always have fun take care and bye